and welcome to this VMAX video tutorial. And now we are going to launch Firestorm. We should already have OpenSim installed, set up. We fixed that little port quirk that we uh, talked about in the last video. So now we're actually going to launch Firestorm and get in there. Now, when you installed Firestorm, it should probably put an icon on your desktop or you can find it in your start menu. I'm just going to click on this. This little gray box will appear in the center of your screen. And here we are in Firestorm. Now, a couple things we have to do here. In the upper left-hand corner, under the Viewer menu, we want to go to Preferences. Now, in case it's not already set, which it may not be, you want to go to Advanced. And under Advanced, there's a checkbox here called Allow Logins to Other Grids. Not all grids will support Firestorm. You want to make sure that is checked. If it's not checked, all you can log into is Linden Labs server. But in our case, we need to log into other uh, other grids, which happens to include our very own local instance of OpenSim. So make sure that is checked. Now go down to OpenSim, and what we're going to enter in here, we want to add a new grid, and we're going to type in localhost, then colon, move that, localhost colon 9000. And then you click Apply. Now, these are the various grids that are available, and I've been setting a few in here. But when you scroll down, what you're going to find is uh, something a little quirky. And oops. You'll find that what it has done is it has found this particular uh, IP address with port 9000, and it's called the Lost Continent of Hippo. And that's the default. When you first install OpenSim, that's their little joke. Uh, they call the, the very first uh, grid that you ever have the Lost Continent of Hippo. We can change that later, uh, but for right now, just remember that that's the name of the grid that's currently living on your server. And you can see it has 127.0.0.1 uh, port 9000, and uh, this IP address is your local machine. It's also local host. It's the local host. Okay, so we have this set up, and in theory now, we can go ahead and uh, we're going to... This, and you're going to hit Apply. Click OK, and now we're going to log in. You want to make sure you're logging onto the grid, Lost Continent of Hippo. It gets cut off. And now we have to remember your username and your password. Hopefully you do. Uh, I called myself Brian Admin. Uh, you can do at Lost Continent of Hippo, but uh, that's good enough. Type in your password and log in. Now, one thing you may notice, I'm going to move this around a little. If all goes well, you're going to start to see a little bit of life in your OpenSim in this uh, this uh, DOS-like window that you have. Uh, while it's trying to, and there you go, you see a bunch of things just happened over in, in our window, and Firestorm is connecting to a region. You're going to get this little message, you can just dismiss that, and what you'll find is now you are in your very own instance of OpenSim. Now, what we have here is a blank OpenSim. It, uh, we just got OpenSim from their website, we installed it clean, uh, we, we're hitting it with a clean installation of Firestorm, and there's nothing in there. All that uh, that's defaulted in the, the lost land of the hippos is uh, one little island floating in a, a bunch of ocean. So uh, in our next video, we're going to start to configure this a little bit uh, more to our liking. We're going to uh, go ahead and install uh, VMAX itself so that it's more than just an island, and uh, maybe we'll see if we can mess around with the configuration files so we're, we're not in uh, the, la the lost continent of hippos. Okay, see you in the next video.